everything could go wrong. And so we are asking people to stop taking medical advice from Donald Trump and Betsy DeVos. Really listen to the school nurse, listen to what the infectious disease experts are saying, and by the way, listen to a school teacher. The, the only person I've heard play politics with this is Donald Trump. It, it's the only one. By the way, wasn't it Donald Trump that when this whole thing happened, he said, it's a hoax, it's the Democrats. And then people started to die. And what's he doing now? We need to open schools or the Democrats are playing politics. No, no, we know who's playing politics with this and, and he should be ashamed. That, that is so callous of him, so callous. When we do it wrong, people die. Little people can get sick. You have asthma, you've got bad allergies, and you're six years old, you could die if we do this wrong. We want our kids back. We don't think you have to choose between having a healthy school um, and opening an unhealthy we We know how to do this. Because if you don't get this right, if there's an oops here, it probably means somebody died. Um, but when that starts to happen, they'll close schools down again. That will impact the economy. That will impact the funding for public school. It will be a vicious, vicious uh, cycle because we had someone in the White House a governor, a senator, who said, just stick the kids back in school. We don't need a plan. Then I want Donald Trump to sit in the back of my class of 39 and breathe their air. I want him to sit there for seven hours, uh, five days a week, and have those kids cough and sneeze on him.